Welcome to 3D Maya tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you some basic techniques of creating a tornado effect using particles and the field vertex. Okay, just create a particle, create emitter, and check the option box and check the create emitter type to Omni. Leave the default settings and create it. Just play. Before playing, just make the timeline to 500 and just play it. You can see that the particles are emitting. Just select the particles and go to fields and click R. Select the R field. Just play the video now. You can see the particles moving to the top, but moving to the top range. Okay. We have to control the particles not to move to the height of this. Okay. So just select the particles and go to the particle shape and just drag down to lifespan mode just select the constant and lifespan to 5 okay now reset and play you can see some difference okay it's fine okay moving going closer now select the particles and just go to fields and go to vertex options and it by default edit reset settings okay create to play this you can see before okay you can even see nothing is happening okay just check the magnitude to some uh, higher value of 3000 okay fine if you play the video you can see the swirl okay this is the tornado effect okay you can control the tornado effects length the size of the tornado by going to particle shape just check the multi streak color render type just drag on to radius a little bit bigger multi count okay to now play it yeah it's fine pretty cool now I'm just going to render in the hardware because particles render in hardware Okay, you can see the vortex feel works so cool in the form of tornado. That's it for today. Thank you for watching this tutorial. This is Satish Room for 3D Maya tutorial. Thank you.